Good morning to all of you. I am Pooja Singh, Faculty SIRTX Department. Today I am going to discuss about mode of heat transfer, that is conduction, convection, and radiation. So the the transmission of the heat energy from one body to another because of the temperature take place by any of n method, that is conduction, convection, and radiation. So what is conduction? When one molecule of substance get heated and transfer the heat to the one and so on the rate of the conduction of heat along the substance depend on the temperature gradient example refractory is heating the heating of insulating material etc second one is convection in this method method the heat transfer take place from one part to another part of substance or fluid due to the actual motion of the molecules example immersion water heater next one is radiation in this method the heat transfer from source to the substance to be heated without heating the medium in between it is depend on the surface rate of heat, uh, rate of heat radiant is is given by the stephen law so this is the basic structure of convection conduction and radiation uh, firstly when we see the mode of convection the heat transfer transfer uh, and second uh, is conduction heat transfer by the mole molecules and last one is radiation so essential required for good heating element first is high specific resistance as we know if resistance uh, current is high then resistance is also uh, if current is uh, resistance is high then uh, heating is also high and second was heating melting point high melting point sorry low temperature coefficient of resistance that is alpha uh, free from oxidation high mechanical strength and non corrosive last one is economical that is most important for electrical point of view and this is the basic structure of electrical heating electrical is heating is basically divided into first is power frequency heating second is high frequency heating if uh, power frequency heating is divided in three part resistance heating arc heating electron bombardment method arc heating is again two type direct arc heating indirect arc heating and resistance heating have three type direct indirect and radiant secondly high frequency heating that is induction and dielectrics and induction method is two type direct induction heating and indirect uh, induction heating that that, uh, that is a flow uh, diagram of electrical heating so this is all about electrical heating uh, in next part we are going dis uh, to discuss about the power frequency heating thank you